Hey, what's up guys, Reese here. Welcome back to another video. This is Iron Man Progress, RS3 edition. I'm getting stared down by this lady for some reason. Um, welcome back. Yeah. Oh, she's gone. Um, yeah. Hey, she's back. In this video. Oh, she's back again. Oh, get out of here. You're ruining my intro, elf lady. I'm trying to... Oh my god. Sorry, I don't want to make you guys dizzy. This is just the best intro ever. Yeah. Oh my god. <laughs> Hey, what's up? <laughs> this is an Iron Man video. Um, in this video, as you guys know, at this point of the series, we're trying to max. we got like five uh, skills left. They all are like a few, like, what, 92 is the lowest stat I have, I think. Or 91, actually. So, yeah. So, we're just trying to max. We're going to be doing, hopefully, a bit of summoning in this. We can't promise 99 because um, with summoning, I'm not sure if I have enough supplies to begin with. And I want to wait for the, um, the well, I'm not sure what hours it is, but the one where you get summoning XP. Uh, so yeah, I'm not going to be doing it unless it's the summoning XP hour, because it's just, I think it's like 20% extra or something silly, so it's not worth not doing it on that time, or something like that. But I just want to say a big thank you for the last video I put out. You guys um, absolutely loved it by the looks, so I got lots of supportive comments, which I really appreciated. The likes, as I record this, it has 129 likes and one dislike, which is really awesome. It's actually funny. I, know, I don't care about dislikes or anything, but normally they get like maybe like, five to ten dislikes per video, which is fine because, you know, you get 100 plus likes, whatever. But this is funny. This had 129 likes, zero dislikes, and then I get a comment that's like, does anyone fucking play RuneScape 3? This is bullshit or something like that. And then um, it had a dislike suddenly. So, hmm, I wonder if that comment and that dislike correlates. But yeah, um, let's hop on into this video. We'll let you guys know what's going on as we do it, but maybe some quests, maybe a bit of summoning training, just working towards maxing. Can't promise what's going on. Maybe a bit of construction in there. But it's uh, going to be a bit jumbled because I want to do summoning, but I can only do it like a few hours a day if that, if you're lucky because that, you've got to wait for the hour. So yeah, let's hop on into it. Let's start with this actually because I do have a challenger that's 4k XP. Let's see how much we get for handing that bad boy in. It's a good start to the summoning. There we go. 48k. Five tortoise shells. I've got a little mini goal in this video with the summoning. Hopefully at least I can get 96, I think it is. Is that Pakyak? That would be really nice to get. Just at least, uh, obviously... 99 is a bit much with waiting for the hours, but 96 would be a good one. I didn't really think of this either, but we should have enough uh, shards and money, because you sell them back or whatever. And I've got uh, eight, 15 mil in, in the old pouch there anyway. I don't know where my things just went. This is time wasting, Reese. Where is it? There we go. Make a little preset. Manage presets. Farming. Save that bad boy. Kerchow. Have a look at this. Booyah. First level. 93. All right. First level of the of the 99 in this video, not really. Um, yeah, cool, sweet. There we are, we went from 92 to 93 and a half. 367k till 94. In the what, 45 minutes, um, maybe a bit less, we did 1800 lobsters. So yeah, bro, you'd probably do like 2500 if you had the full hour. 2500 pouches an hour, something like that, maybe three grand if you're a fucking god. And if you're doing it more efficiently in better places, so I'm just doing it Prif because I like it. And, oh, oh, well, I guess Prif is the way to do it these days if you, if you want that 20% extra XP. But I guess now we go kill some water fiends or something, I suppose. Yeehaw! 107 ranging. We're going to take a break from getting them charms now. 385 crimsons. 385 out of about probably about 5,000 I'll need because the XP boost and saving them from the gems. And, yeah... Kerchow, 94. All right, guys. Hopefully the video is been. Oh, I said all right, guys. Fuck. Um, hopefully the video has been like watchable so far. I've had to delete a bunch of clips. I deleted like I think five minutes worth of clips, was just because um I like figured stuff out of what I was doing for summoning my plans to get 99 or to train it. And, like, it just rambled on with the other ones. Like, because, like, I was, like, I laid out my whole plan of how I was going to train summoning. And it was, like, me talking for, like, a few minutes. And then I just figured out recently a different way to do it. And I was, like, well, I can't put them both in the video because it's just literally pointless. Um, and I don't want to do it that badly. So what I've done is I've deleted a few clips. Hopefully it still makes sense. But at the start of the video, I was thinking of just doing granite um, lobsters. And then I was going to do, get some more charms, like do as much granite lobsters as I could, which because I had heaps of granite in the bank and I broke that down to smaller bits of granite, so I had enough. And then I was, because I had about 10k uh, crimson charms, I was going to do that. And then I think it was around 6k or 7k crimsons from um, 96 to 99 using pack yaks. It's like 6k pack yaks. So I was like, if I do that, all I have to do is then get a few thousand uh, crimson charms from water fiends in between. But I've just realized, as you guys may see, I'm level 94 now. 
But I forgot, I had like 1700 blues. I forgot about blue charms. I knew about them, but I know I had no secondaries. But I didn't realize, I was like, all the secondaries are too hard to get. Like, I can't, like, actually properly farm, like, any talismans can't farm. Fire talismans, water talismans, actually, like, consistently. So I was like, oh, that's pointless. Let's just do crimson. Then I was like, well, 1700 blues. Let's just make some rune minotaurs or something. They're still pretty damn decent XP. So now I'm just going to mine, like, 1500 rune, turn that into 1500 rune bars. Boom. Bob's your uncle. And there's, um, that would be a few, that's like over a mil XP just there. That's like pretty close to maybe with a 20% boost, I think like 700 each XP each. I make 1500, probably, yeah, probably click on one, one and a half mil XP easy. So that's the goal now. That will boost us to, well, 96. And then we should have enough crimsons just to go to 96 to 99, just straight off pack yaks like that. So the grind's done. I just have to mine all this rune ore. We're done. We don't have to mine any, uh, kill any more monsters for ch uh, charms or anything. So 99 summoning in this video. Let's do it. All right, guys. Sorry about the... Oh, fuck. <laughs> start the clip with all right. Hello, guys. All right. Fuck. Shit. Um, it's hard to start the clip without saying all right. We're going to make some bars. We've got 1,300. We have to do a bit more because we actually have around 1,700 blue blue charms. I thought I had less. But we got this and the gloves, so maybe we'll get a few from doing that. But we'll do this, see how it goes. Um, there we go. Extra bar. So we should get a few hundred extra bars, maybe, if we're lucky. Probably about 20. Um... So we'll do that, and then we'll have to mine a bit more. But we're going to start off by making 1,300 rune bars real quick. It won't be quick. And we're getting closer. Closer and closer to that 99 summoning. It's achievable in this video. I'm surprised. All right. This is... A, I did it again. This is an awkward moment. With the uh, mining and smithing rework, I want to get my bars out now, and I don't know how to do it. There's withdraw all materials, deposit all materials. If I click this... Like, don't worry. I will figure out how to get it, of course. But it's funny. It's like, I don't actually know how to do it. And I'm being blind probably, but this is crazy. Give me the bars. How do I take them out of the bank without taking every bar out of the bank? <laughs> I'm being stupid, but maybe for just for now, because I literally have no idea what the fuck's going on, I'm just going to withdraw them all, bank the room bars, and just tr plop them all back in, because I actually don't know what the fuck is going on here, because I'm an idiot. XP time. I'm hoping with uh, these 1600 um, blue charms that we can get 96 in within this hour. We've only got 50 minutes left and we haven't started yet and we're going the wrong way. But I'm hoping we can get 96 because that would be absolutely bloody lovely. Oh, bloody smooth 22k XP per use of the obelisk. That is very lovely. Well, guys, here it is. Booyah! 96 summoning that's a goal we've wanted for ages as you can imagine because who bloody does not want 96 summoning the pack yak elusive illustrative sought after achieved by myself an absolute god and we still have 10 minutes on this hour beautiful two mil xp an hour easy doing these these bad boys it's lovely that's some xp i'm gonna keep on going use these all up while i'm at it that should be the last one I'm going to do because the hour's about to swap on over. And it's near enough at EXP. We should have enough probably with the 20% boost to get 99 just off Crimson Pack Yaks. Well, Pack Yaks. Using Crimson Charms anyway. 8k Charms, yeah. That's enough. 8k Pack Yaks, I think, is enough for 99 without the bloody hour multiplier. So we should be Gucci fam. Which is good because we only have 5k Yak Hides, but we can buy 1k right now. So our 1600 Blue Charms. Using um, the uh, Spirit Emeralds, we made 1,900 room Minotaur pouches. Bloody have a look at that. That's amazing. What I do do want to do, do though, is grab this, this, this. Um, oh, hour just changed. I want to see how much XP you get for an inventory of these for the old pack yaks. So we'll see that anyway. And I guess we can uh, see how much we will get when we're... Uh, Get an extra 20%, we can just sort of like assume. 10k already, wow, so yeah. Well, 12k, I guess. 20% on top of 10k, 12k XP per inventory. Is that maths? Is that how that works? It's about half the XP rate of Rune Minotaurs. That's really good. I can start training that now. I'm just going to do another inventory just real quick, just so we can get placeholders and stuff, because that is so awesome. Where did my... What's happening? That is so good to have that, and I don't have to worry about getting War Tortoises or bloody... Pack Pigs got the best, well, one of the best. I don't think it's the best B.O.B. anymore. There's, like, other ones. But this is the best all-rounder, easy-to-get, sort of basic bitch one you can get these days. 
can, what, hold 28, 32, 30, some shit like that? Uh, what have I forgotten? I've oh, just got an inventory. Fucking yak hides. I'm a genius. And then, of course, the scrolls to the bank, which I'm not sure. With it, with alking and disassembly, I'm not sure if that's even super useful these days, but still somewhat useful. At least I can see it's really easy to get your supplies. Bloody 200 scrolls. That's like, 200 scrolls is a lot, and that took about quarter second. That was one inventory. Not even using all the things. So it's nice... Chuckle these bad boys in here. That's going to go buy another 6k things. I might just grind it out in a row, to be honest. Like, I don't, I don't have to, but it's nice to know I can just grind the 99 if, if I want to grind it, which is really nice to know. Um, but yeah, be quicker if I just wait for the 20%. But if I can't wait, I can just get straight on there. Yeah, from 10 mil XP to 99, it is 7. Point, uh, wait, 7.1k pack yaks, apparently without any boosts or anything. So that is doable. Oh shit, I'm 138 combat. Did I get an achievement for that? Or did I get that before? I don't see any messages. Interesting. Max combat. Also, where the hell am I running? Jesus, what am I doing? Congrats to my boy Labrat for getting the Master Quest Cape. Something I will never achieve. Hell yeah. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Every time, sorry, the beeps are mine. Every time I click the wrong thing, but I was gonna say, love a bit of free XP, 215k, I'm thanking you. How much XP I get, I mean, shards I get back for these bad boys. Oh, 535k spirit shards, thank you very much. One of your crafted pouches forms into a baby yak in your backpack. That's not a pet, is it? Oh, no, of course, that's like a player and farms thing. Huh. Okay. I was just doing a little rune run to make some viswax and stuff. I just like to buy runes every day to just get a massive collection in the bank for no reason. And I have eight coins. Yep, eight coins, boys. I've spent the last all my money on shards, and I'm gonna have to refund some of my Pakyak pouches, which is really upsetting me. We will get 99. We're 789k to 99 summoning. We're out of shards at the moment. Uh, well, we're not completely out of shards. We have what? 30k, I think 24k. We have no coins. We have two and a half thousand pack yaks, but I don't want to hand them in. They're my pack of yakis. So we're kind of like in the middle of we're throwing some stuff in the auto alk, or we're going to find some stuff to alk because I want to find. I want to buy some fucking coins. Uh, no, don't buy some coins. I want to. Uh, whatever I'm talking. You know, I want to get nine nine uh, summoning. I need some shards. Fucking hell, gimme. And I got no money. Here we go. The moment we've been waiting for for quite some time. We sorted out our money and stuff. We didn't have to refund too much pouches. We found some stuff to alk and all that sort of thing. But there is 99 summoning. Wowzer. Achieved at 7.32am in the morning. <laughs> uh, game of life. No, I woke up at 5am for unrelated adult lifing thing. So that was great. Um, oh my god, look at all these things I've achieved. Yes. So now I have one, two, three, four. Four 99s left until we max a fucking Iron Man. Oh my god. I can't believe I'm I'm gonna max an Iron Man. That is ridiculous. Wow. Uh, look at this though. We ended up with, because we didn't have to hand in too much, luckily. So we ended up with actually 2,000 Pachyaks and 20,000 Scrolls. Which is, you know, enough for quite a while actually. Like, that is a lot. Like, I think that's, yeah, that's a lot. And then I can... Alk them or something for like 6k cash, or, uh, 6 mil cash if I want. Or hand them back in, sell the thing, something like that. But I would just keep them forever because that will last me like ages. 2,000 pack yaks. 20,000 scrolls. Love and life, boys. Oh yeah. Let's go. Let's collect the big fat loots. Four weeks, three days. So five weeks. No, that's not how math works. Mahogany loggies. That's what I want. That's 6.2k mahogany planks pretty much coming into the game there for me. Um, yeah, we can go chuck that in the plank maker. I think, I don't know, I'm not sure if the next, next video or next 99 is going to have to be construction, I suppose. And then after that, Dungeoneering can't really train while I can, but, you know, can get easily five, six, seven hundred k XP a week based off just doubling Dungeoneering challenges. Obviously, I'm not going to get Dungeoneering challenge every day, but it is, at this point, I've got four 99s. It's like quite um 499 until max so it's like quite likely you get a dungeoneering challenge at least two a week so it's like yeah it could be like 500k xp because you can get like oh maybe 440k xp a week plus the dungeons you actually complete yeah about 500k xp a week 
we're not actually doing anything off Dungeoneering, so that's quite good. Um, what the fuck was that? Charlie just launched into his hay bucket thing I've got. That's great, he loved that. Um, so yeah, Dungeoneering, not a big deal. Agility, we're gonna, like I say, we're gonna do quests and just the daily posts as much as we can. So really the grind is only construction and fletching. Fletching is once another thing I want to wait as long as I can just so I can buy my, um, board, uh, my, uh, head, head things every week, every day, uh, broadless arrows. So yeah, that's a kind of another one I gotta, like, wait for. So yeah, it's kind of it's, it's teetering down. It's, it's getting there. At one point, we're just gonna have to take out like two weeks to just grind a fucking bunch of quests, though. So for agility, and then after we do that, all those quests, we'll still have to then train agility as well. That's the really annoying part. If we can do all these quests, borderline quest cape to get some XP for agility, it's only gonna put us at like 95, and then I'm gonna be upset because I have to fucking train it, and which I'm really not looking forward to, guys. I don't want to do agility. I did um, a few, I think, five laps of the Heffin course. Um, yesterday, and it was maybe want to die. Anyway, plank wise, we got 25k, so 30k mahogany planks. We got an, uh, 51k teak planks. We have, um, I don't know where my teaks are, if we have any left. I don't know if I'm being blind. Oh, another 10k teak planks to come in. So, yeah, overall, we have what, 80k planks in total with a mismatch between teak and mahogany and stuff. There you go, so take them out. Take them out, get the mahoganies in there. Um, yeah, I'm not sure if that's enough for 99, but it's, um, it's a start, I guess. Ah, oh, it's going to be really upset if I get all these skills and use all my supplies and then I'm just, like, stuck. Like, I don't want to be, like, stuck at, like, 97 construction with no, no way to train. That's going to be fucking depressing. I have to go, like, old school and start, like, fucking wood cutting, like, wood cutting, like, just cutting down teaks and banking it just to finish off the 99. Something like that's going to have to happen, I bet. Alright, here comes the first good loot on the Iron Man. Um, fucking hell. We'll come back for more disappointment a month from now. Also, I hate to say it, guys, but I think we're going to have to end the video here. I just checked it. It's like, um, what, 17 minutes long or something already. Um, I didn't realize, and I don't know. I feel It's one of those videos where I feel like it's, it is a lot of rambling, but we also knocked off another 99, like, back-to-back -back after the last 99 in the last video, I think. We'll do... I don't know. What... Did we get 9900 in the last video? Is that what that was? I feel like... <laughs> <laughs> I'm losing track here these days. But yeah, we definitely got 99 in this video. I know that much. Um, yeah, so that was awesome. We did that. And I don't know. What can I say? I tried my best, and I hope you guys enjoyed it. Um, you guys killed the uh, episode 251 with a like, so that was awesome. 100, as I record this video, you guys saw the intro I talked about it, but... 159 likes now as I end this video. So that is fucking lit. You guys are awesome. See you in the next one. Um, sorry about the streams, by the way, guys. Been busy. I'm not, um, yeah, what can I say? I normally uh, stream on my days off, but my day... I was complicated. You guys don't need to know about it. But see you guys. <laughs> sorry about that. Try to stream when we can. Um, you know, Don't sub to me with real money on Twitch. That's all I should say. Because I feel bad. There's a thing I should mention that. I feel really bad about not streaming. Like, if I didn't... Well, if you guys weren't, like, subbing to me on Twitch, I wouldn't care, like, that much. But I feel bad when you guys have subbed to me on Twitch, because, like, you guys are giving me money, and then I'm just like, oh, bye. It's, like, really annoying. Like, I don't feel as bad if it's Twitch Prime, but there is a few subs that are just, like, with real money. Like, because Twitch Prime isn't costing you anything, so it's, like, I don't feel guilty or anything. But, yeah, if I'm not streaming and you guys are giving me, like, proper hard-earned cash, I feel really dodgy. But I just can't do it. I'm trying my best, guys. And sometimes I'm like, I can stream, but it's maybe worth me grinding out those few extra hours on a video instead and finishing the video. So it's like a toss up between that. Anyway, love you guys. See you in the next one. Bye-bye.